This is the Symphonic Grand Piano Set. You can get it at Walmart or Amazon that I know of. And it comes with a stool. And um, my son never uses the stool, but an older child might sit down on it and play the piano. My uh, almost two-year-old prefers to stand. And let's see. It opens up here. And that's as far as it opens. And there is a little stand here to hold it up. And inside there's a storage compartment for the uh, microphone. And this hooks here. And that. And then the microphone plugs in. And there is an on and off switch on the microphone. I'm going to go ahead and turn it on. And then I'm going to turn the piano on here. And you have different settings. You've got piano, guitar, organ, violin, trumpet, mandolin, <laughs> flute, and a music box. So, and each of those plays a different instrument when you play the keys. Then all the way over in this corner. We have different tempos. And this one is going to be rock and then slow rock, new new, disco, march, waltz, sambo, and blue. And that they can play the keys with those beats. This button over here, if you switch it, there's two options for each beat. So you have two rock beats. That's a rock beat. And then click it again, and that's rock beat style um, one. So you can switch back and forth between those two. So that's pretty cool. You've got a lot of different options there. And if you want to stop it at any point, there's a stop button up here, and that stops it. So lots of different buttons, lots of different fun stuff. Um, keep them occupied. Up here, you have a tempo, um, a tempo positive and a tempo negative to uh, make it faster and slower. I'll go ahead and show you that. And it's, you can see how it's slowing down. And then here, you can make it go faster very 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 annoyingly fast and then the next two buttons are volume up and down so you can make it quieter or louder so that's all really neat and then once again stop stops it all um, they have a try me button that just kind of plays a demo and um, you can't play the keys while that's working, but um, then stop, and then they have a demo song, and there's a couple of different songs that it plays there. And then stop. And then you have the metronome, and that ticks so that you can play in rhythm. And you can hit stop to stop that, and that helps you count notes. And um, that button says play right. And It makes the keys actually play a chord.
So um, hit stop, and then you have your record and your playback button further down, down here towards the end. And the record button is really cool. Let me uh, zoom out. And what it does, if you hit record, and then you can hit playback, and you can see it's blinking, so it's playing back the music that I just played. And kids have a lot of fun with that. And um, it does not record anything that's said through the microphone. It only records the keys being played. So that is something that I didn't realize at the beginning. But um, something to take note of. But just hit stop once again. And that will stop it. And um, this is the microphone. And it's my son's favorite part of the entire thing. And actually, give me just a moment. Sing in the microphone. Go do 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 do. There you go. Oh, yeah. There you go. Okay. And you can hear how loud the microphone is. So that is really cool, and he has a lot of fun with that. And I'm trying to see. Okay. Sing. The volume button does not seem to. Okay, sing. Go. Yeah, the volume button does not have any effect on the microphone. It's just at a, a certain amplified. And um, I think that's about it. It is a really cool toy. Um, here is the manual. They have it marked for three years and up. But um, my son has been playing with it since he was about 14 months old. And he loves it. We usually keep the microphone. keep the microphone put up unless I'm around and I keep this lid snap and it snaps hard enough that he cannot get into it unless I open it which is kind of sad because he can't turn it on himself but um, it does work out nicely so that I can store the microphone in there and not worry about it getting lost or anything like that but um, oh, you need the stand It does have a quick shut off. Um, actually, I'm waiting and I'll show you on the video. It turn off. And that's its automatic shut off, um, which was about three minutes after he last touched it. And I think that's about it. So have a good day and I hope that helps.